Hello, my name is Ivo Peralta. I'm the head sommelier at the Jean Sequa Club, a private members club in Lisbon. I was awarded the best sommelier of Portugal in 2018 and I've represented Portugal in the late world best sommelier in the world in 2019 in Belgium. Today we are going to demonstrate how to open a vintage port and how to decant it. And the vintage that will open Dow's 1985 Beautiful uh, vintage and one of the best uh, from the 80s decade. To um, make the decantation of this uh, vintage port, that was 1985, we will use the port tank. And the first step is to uh, eat it up this. This needs to stay in contact with the fire for about 10 to 15 minutes. So in the meantime, while the port tanks are heating, I will show you how to open a bottle of vintage port with your normal tools that you have at home. The first, the traditional corkscrew. You just um, cut the foil, usually like half percent of it. I will also show you how to open a bottle with this blader's uh, corkscrew. In the vintage ports with around 15 to 20 years old or more, with a long uh, time of aging, it's normal that the cork is starting to get stuck into the neck of the glass, right, of the bottle. So this corkscrew will help you to not destroy the cork since not all of us have a port stung at home to open these old vintage ports, right? And this is very simple to use. You have two points, all right? First, the bigger point, slowly starting to insert, and after the other point. And after that, it just goes slowly starting to insert the corkscrew. And now we will use the port tank. This is very, very hot. We'll insert this around three quarters of the um, cork. We need to turn around in both sides a little bit just to be sure that all the glass is in contact with the metal. And it's broke. The thing that I do is gently remove a little of the um, bottle's neck and after that I'll pour a little more of this water just to prevent that any uh, glass go into the bottle, into the wine. It's perfectly safe. We'll took slowly and here it is. Now, to proceed to the decantation, we'll gently remove the bottle and just give a little pour on the port glass. Gently insert again. Now we'll check if the wine is sound before the decantation. Usually the corks used on the port are quite good, so there's rarely we see a spoilage bottle of port. The wine smells beautiful. To do this, just to remove any dishwasher um, material, some water that could be inside of the decanter, just for the wine to be uh, perfect when we'll serve it to our guests. Usually, we don't do the decantation until the end. These old uh, ports, it's natural, creates the sediment, and we'll need to stop before just to prevent any and the, of this sediment will ruin the, the wine afterwards. And ready to be served to our guests. So, thank you very much for watching how to decant a bottle of vintage port. And uh, don't forget to continue to watch these videos at the School of Port. And if you want to know more about me, follow on Instagram 
at Ivo Peralta underscore sommelier.